artist Arts for Lawrence has you covered. Uh, Jay, uh, please introduce us to this lovely lady right here. Uh, Deanna Polsma, she is one of our resident artists. We have yes. two resident artists, and she is in charge of our new ceramic studio. This is lovely. De Deanna, yes, how are you doing over there? I'm doing great. <laughs> I'm getting my hands dirty. Oh, my goodness. Jay, uh, what is it like to be able to offer something like this for, for anybody who's getting started doing this thing? It's super exciting because we make it accessible. So mm -hmm. whether you, you are a ceramics artist from birth or you yeah. are someone who is just getting their hands dirty for the first time, Deanna is a great teacher. So you can come and have a four-week class with us, okay. two, night, two hours every week, or you can come for a Saturday afternoon okay. or a Saturday night with the girls or the guys or the family. Yeah. So it's something for everybody. It's inexpensive as well. Awesome. So. Deanna, what's it like to be able to share this art uh, with the community? You, you know, it's amazing. It's actually always been a, a dream of mine to be able to just kind of go and play with clay every day and uh -huh. teach others just the joy of art and having fun and forgetting the world for a minute and how do, do people kind of get frustrated when they're just learning and it, and it doesn't look as pretty as what you're oh, doing of course of course <laughs> and that's one of the first things we say is if you've never done it before fully expect to do what we call flop in a pot which means mm -hmm. it's just going to collapse on itself it's going to look like over, whatever and we're going to get you there oh, we're going to get yes. you there you will leave with something by okay. the end of the class for sure. I think I'm getting ready uh, to get into this you class. You are indeed. You're about to get into oh, it. Oh boy. Yeah. Uh, so how long did it take you to be able to do what you do now? Oh, so I've been doing ceramics for 15 years now. Okay. Um, but really getting decent at wheel throwing probably about two to three years. Well, Just okay. practicing all the time. So. All right. I've given this like one shot in my life, Jay. Uh, we're going to see if the second time goes way better than the first time. <laughs> all right. Okay. So we're going to get this cleared off. Okay. And we're cool. going to get you a new piece of clay. Oh. And we're a new one? I was just going to use one. yours. Oh. And just, oh, no. You want to get yourself a new one. You're going to make a really lovely yeah. ashtray today. Oh. <laughs> Here we go. Okay. All right. So, have a little seat with authority. There. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. All right. So you're gonna start by getting your hands wet. Okay. Just, just wet. Yep. Get them, okay. get them nice and wet, both okay. hands. Okay. And you're gonna spin the wheel. Okay. You use the little use foot the pedal. Okay. You don't have to keep your foot on the pedal. Okay. You're gonna use both hands coming in from either side. Okay. You're gonna apply even pressure, and okay. you're gonna use your hands to move the clay. So you're essentially squeezing it together okay. to push it into the middle. Okay. So I'm gonna grab your hand to kind of. Okay. Move it a little bit. So you're gonna. Oh, we're gonna, oh, okay. We got. Oh, we're getting in there. Yeah. All right. And now you're going to take your top hand, okay. and you're going to push down from the top okay. the same way to kind of compress the clay. So you're okay. going to try and keep your arm steady, smooth it out. Okay. Use and if it starts guns. getting hot, you might have to get a little <laughs> bit more water. Okay. So you said I might need more water? Yep. Okay. Yep. And then I'm, if you're oh, you know what you're doing. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. Oh, oh, that's, that's an A class. You know, that's yeah. an A class. Yeah. Everybody's being very quiet. Yeah. So then just here. steady your hands a little bit more. So just kind of pressure. keeping it. Okay, keep a little pressure what, on what there. There you go. Okay. So now gently lift both hands away. Okay. Don't goof up right now. Oh, so we're getting close. Okay. So push down a little bit more from the top there. Okay. The pressure's on, buddy. Pressure's a little bit on. more. Deanna, do you right, need a commentary in the background that I'm getting? <laughs> <laughs> right. All right, now release, and we should be close to center there. Okay. We're getting there. So see how there's a little bit of a wobble? Use more of the palm of your hand more to push more. into it. Push a little bit yeah, more? Yeah, push okay. into it with the palm of your hand. Okay. Randall, you're doing a great job. You really are. Right. Thanks, Randy. Appreciate it. I appreciate the sarcasm that came with that, too. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. How are we doing? Yeah, so we're doing we're doing good. Okay. So now we're going to do what's called opening up. So you're going to use your thumbs okay. to go into the middle of it okay. and slowly push down into the middle there. Okay. And keep try and keep your hands steady. Okay. Try to keep them steady. Yep. All right. And there you're going to you push. Go. You're going to go all the way down. So you got about a quarter of an inch of clay left on the bottom. Okay, all the way down. All right. I'll give you some more water, water there. there. All right. All right. Okay. There we go. Keep going. Look at us. Going. Look at us yeah. making art out here. <laughs> So what are you making? What's it going to be? Uh, I have no idea. Uh, so <laughs> you let the you clay be abused. <laughs> Whatever you say it is, you're correct. There you go. Right. So uh, whenever we're doing ceramics, the basic form is going to be a cylinder, and from a cylinder, you can pretty much much make anything. So once once you've got the cylinder down, you can make a cup, you can make a bowl, we can okay. make a plate. Awesome. You can make you can make a rain gauge. Sure, Randy. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Okay. All right. See how, how, we'll right see how far down we got. Pull okay. your hands out so we can take a little look. Okay. Yeah, we're going down pretty far. So you're actually going to slow the wheel down okay, a little bit. Down. And so the next part is 
Yep, right about there. Okay. So you're going to, with two hands, you're going to use this hand on the outside. You're going to use this kind of knuckle. Okay. Keeping it straight up so and down. So knuckle here? Yep, so it's going to be on the outside of the clay. Okay. And then this finger, I'm mm -hmm. going to use your middle finger, uh -huh. and you're going to compress the clay. Okay. And together, your fingers are going to stay, and they're going to move slowly up. And this is called pulling a wall. So you're going to start at the bottom. Okay. As an example. Okay. And once it makes a little revolution, you're slowly moving both hands together up. Nice. Y'all stay so. tuned, George and Randy. <laughs>